Whew. Gonna shake it off. Hey, heroes, Isaac Zephyr here, and welcome back to Pokemon Conquest. When last we left off, we unlocked these four kingdoms to be able to take on. And, oh man, there's another one in there. Oh, I'm not even allowed to check. It is Gold Warrior Central up in here. There's, They're all over the place. So we got three that we want to get. Unfortunately, our roster's currently full. So, if I'm gonna get them, I'm gonna have to kick other people out. And I just got IG back. He's he's a nice guy. I don't wanna don't wanna kick him out again. So what I've done is I've put together the team that I'm thinking is gonna be best to take on Cragspur here, and we're gonna try to take on Cragspur first and then get all these warriors afterwards. And it may be two episodes, I don't know how long this Cragspur fight is. So, unfortunately we got two normal types in the party, so they're not gonna be super great against these rock types, but we should be fairly okay with everybody else. We got some pretty strong members there. Quagsire unfortunately doesn't have a water move anymore, he's got Mud Bomb, which is ground, but it's still going to be good against the majority of what's here. So, I'm feeling Quagsire's the big guns, and then Trico's there to take out some of these dual type guys. So, without any further ado, let's throw our head in the ring. Most of the warriors in Quagsire have rock type Pokemon for partners. Water type, grass type, and fighting type Pokemon are strong against rock type Pokemon, but fire types and bug types are pretty useless. Normal type Pokemon's attacks aren't very effective either. All right, so as per normal, I have to take them, and then let's go. I need to get them out of Elusio so that I can actually get in there. Victory or defeat, which will it be? Let us take a gamble. All right. So you're Lee, the one who's captured all those castles in the west. Half of Ranse is already yours. What are you going to do next? Too much ambition can be pretty dangerous, you know. This isn't ambition. Quiet, you! We don't have time to listen to your silly excuses. That's right, I have things to do. Let's get this settled. Alright. It's a 20 turn. We're a little bit more powerful, but then again, we got two guys who basically can't hurt him. We got rocks. I think I recall this fight being dicks. Alright. It's just a fight. Something I've got to protect. That's why I fight. I'm sorry, but I won't be holding back. That's fine. What's your movement? And yours. Yeah, if she fires like right there, it's gonna send the boulder right through here, so I need to make sure that people are out of the way. I'm not gonna worry too much about Jigglypuff. I'm gonna let the Jigglypuff open these doors. Okay. Hmm. They might be able to hit these rocks. Let's try to get only not very effective things in there. And guard Trico with our life. Because he's very useful in this fight as opposed to the last one. I don't want to be in the line of that boulder, so I'm going to move in there. Quagsire, you're resistant to rock, and let's get you up that way. See how this goes. They're coming! Here we go! As anticipated. That's why I moved everything out of the way, because it's painful. And... Not very effective. Alright. Quagsire's got this shit. Okay. Alright. Let's move our way around. Wake up! Wake up every morning. All right. Kind of want to waste this boulder. Nope, can't do it with absorb. Okay. Not too bad. Let's get Eevee out this way. Let's try to get Jigglypuff to take on that uh, that little guy. Okay both of them going up here. As 
Quagsire, you're gonna solo these two. Because <laughs> you're a boss. You're like one of my most powerful, not special warlords. This is gonna hurt though. Ow. I've chunked his army pretty nice though. Range down, that's gonna suck. I love the smell of the battlefield. For this battle, Galad and I will put the world to rights. I'm gonna try to slip around here. Let's see if I can't pull off two good attacks. Curses, well, the next one will definitely win. Also, I don't think that I can actually recruit any of the guys from these battles because Nobu's, no, they're all Nobunaga's army, not individual countries. All right, it's them. Gerda, you're gonna help me kick the crap out of this guy. Whap! Most excellent. And Trico, your job. Jesus Christ, it's gotta have defense through the roof. In order to be able to resist an attack like that. That or Trico is just terrible, and I'm I'm doing my best to make a shitty Pokemon work. Oh, come on. I know it's a Jigglypuff, but you can cut me a little bit of slack, can't you? Let's take out that Larvitar. No effect! That there is some bullshit. Oh, she got a potion. Currently pretty ahead. I'm still concerned though. Shit, a flinch. Ah, suck it. Alright. I'm flinched, I can't move. Um I could probably put off doing that still. Get a few good hits. Come on. Got me some slack here. Doing the best I can. Alright, let's avoid letting her hit more than one of my guys at once. Ugh. Yeah. Alright, doing okay on that front. You could wake up slap. Wow. I think we basically got this. Let's keep Trico safe this time. You can do it, kick his ass, Trico. Yeah, I think this battle's won. The Machop may still cause me some issues, but once Gallade's no longer dealing with this Pancham, I think I'm gonna be fine. Stop targeting Jigglypuff. Bonus defense. Keeps going after Eevee, that's fine. Eevee's more or less a weak link in this battle, unfortunately. Okay. Get Trico's job done. Which is this Onyx. I will not forget your face. That's fine. 
Not asking you to forget my face. As a matter of fact, I'm asking you to remember my face. Hit you with a strong wake up slap. Ugh, I can't be doing this anymore. Um, you know what? I think the other end's gonna be fine. Let's grab that. We're gonna play the do -si do a little bit. Hit you with a mud bomb. They got pants here, it's quite a feat, I tell ya. I tell ya what. Okay, we're gonna get you grab that. It's all she wrote. Oh, our enemies are simply too powerful. Um, I'm gonna keep the full heal, it's pretty good. We're gonna go with that full heal, or that nice big heal. Yeah, it's... It's over. He might get Jigglypuff, that's about it. But once Galate's turn rolls around, that's... that's it. I don't think he's gonna survive one. Oh no, Jigglypuff, I'm sorry, it's time for us to retreat. You know what, Trico, grab your, uh, grab your victory... gold. And then, yeah, let's call it a day. Good old Kinchin. We shall withdraw. That's Cragsburg Castle. Excellent. Good experience. Uh, Potion and Ash and Grace. They all went off. No, we lost again! First Nobuganaga, now this. Uh, maybe I'm getting old. Okay, looks like I don't have a choice. The castle's yours, Lee. But what will you do? We belong to Nobunaga's army. Now that our castle's gone, we've got to go back to him. I don't much like that, Nobunaga, but I can't see it any other way. See you, Lee. I hope one day you become strong enough, too. Lee's army claimed victory. <gasps> And Trico's evolving! Finally! I was expecting this last time. Yeah, it's gonna be a nice power boost for the army. More evolutions! More! More! I've had quite a few, like, random evolutions, too. So we got a nice Grovile. Well, well, well! Now that you've always feel something special between us, cool. Together they'll be unstoppable. Hey, it's you again! How's everything going? Hey, you! Wait, something's changed. You're right, Lady Lee has transformed. I knew it. Well, that's good news. Here, let me give you a little something to celebrate. Cool. I received some stones. If you go into battle after giving one of the one of those to a certain Pokemon, like your little Eevee, you might just see something pretty special. Each stone will lead to a different result, but your little Pokemon might just evolve. Think about it and use them wisely. You know, you really are looking pretty impressive these days. I don't think you'd be needing any more advice from me. In fact, I'd better be off. See you around. Save progress. I'm not gonna evolve Eevee right now, because I... Thinking in the long run, considering that Nobunaga's dragon types, I need, a ty I need Glaceon if I'm gonna actually win that fight. So, we're gonna wait for that. That, however, opens up our three kingdoms here for getting what we want. So, Lucio, looking at it, we need quite a few different things. Psychic type would be good, and we need something that's going to take that Curlia down quick. So, I'm going to move you two, because flying on that map is useful. And bug type is super effective, so that's good. We need another good strong psychic type person, which I don't think we have. Like, psychic is severely lacking. But we put flying there, and that should be good. That should cover that weakness. Uh, trying to think of anybody else that would be good. You know what? I'm actually gonna march you up there as well. Just to make it three on four. As for the other two, 
you are fire guy, so I need somebody... How many warlords do I have left? I've got him. And I've got her. And this one's ice, I believe? Yeah, ice. So let's march you to here. Let's get this person out of the way. That maximized Arbok. That isn't even his preferred link. Alright, so let's see. Uh, let's do this one first. Because it's going to be the hardest. Shall we set off? All I need to do is hit it with one good rock wrecker, but actually getting that accuracy lined up is going to be potentially tough. And I also need to get a perfect link while I'm here. So what's your movement? Yeah, like, getting that lined up is gonna be... Okay, so let's move you there, just to occupy that space. You need to get that timber, so move you up there. And something like... this? Yeah, if I can hit it with a good rock wrecker, that's gonna be game, set, match on this one. Problem is hitting that rock wrecker. God damn it. God damn it. That's what these timbers always running away from me. Alright. Line up the shot. And he's going for the pitch! And done. I'm sure all the world will know of your talents before too long. Yeah, it's Karate Chop, you. Whatcha? I'm gonna hit you with a solid bug bite just to finish you off. This is gonna add more typings to our stuff overall. Okay, so let's see which way this Conkholder goes. Perfect! Or, two, you will be a Conkholder someday. I can't use Rock Rook for twice, so might as well pick this stuff up. It's been a while since I've actually visited the store or anything, but in this particular... Conquest... There's really no need for it. End the turn. Ow. Alright. Let's finish this up. Excellent. Definitely recruit her. I believe she wants a snow runt. I don't think we're gonna get her perfect link anytime soon. So let's get him with the timber. And just so I know. There we go. Alright, next we're gonna focus on the Lucio battle, because it's gonna be tough. Time for some fun, I say! Okay. So, he's up there at the blue. Almost weary about it. 
let's go to here rather than commit to anything. Try to get as many of them down first turn as possible because they do outnumber me right now. No match. Okay, so he's gonna teleport blue. This is again where flying is helpful. Yep, he's gonna teleport blue. Okay. said, still got to get people around. Let's get that marksman up. I'm more concerned with you, so hopefully we can get a good critical hit. Nope. Because this is going to teleport him away. Ah, come on! I was going to say we'll still be hitting four turn minimum if we can hit that. God damn it. Now I'm in a pickle. Oh, this is going to hurt. Ow. Lower all their attack, that's good. You get to here at least. I want a critical hit on him. Actually, I need one if I'm gonna actually take him out. There we go, perfect. We fought tooth and nail, but I sense we could one day be allies. Hopefully that day is today. You know, I'm, I'm gonna avoid teleporting him around the world. <laughs> Why, hello. That's a problem. Okay, let's do one of these. Three new warriors for the army. Hooray! And teleport away. I haven't actually been using Yoshimoto very much since I got him. Alright, the confusion, that's fine. Go grab this while we're here. And a good smacking. And that's all. Oh, come on! Okay. Now a good smacking. There we go. That was a huge power boost for Pineco. Alright, Munitoke and Yuji. Alright, that's fine. Let's recruit them. Hey, it's great. Use me as much as you can, alright? Thank you for so much. I shall gladly go with you. Let us join together towards the truth. I think his uh, bit is Abra. Yeah, this is kind of the bit where you get a lot of people who don't actually have their perfect links yet. Alright, you guys... You're not the greatest people for doing this, but you're the people doing this, so... Luxray, you're gonna target that T-Pig like nobody's business. It's not gonna be fair, it's not gonna be nice, it's gonna be... 
done. Alright, I'm gonna move Joltik way down here. This is not the fight for him. Matter of fact, I'm gonna move everybody back. Because half these people aren't actually very good fighters. <laughs> this is gonna be a tougher fight than the last two. But I imagine it'll last those five minutes. Needs this beedrill as bait. Ow. Hey, the bait worked! Alright, let's see. What's the best method of going at this? I'm thinking this one. Got a nice poison. Most impressed. Thank you. I try. <laughs> Yum. Ooh, a flinch. Nice. Uh, all right. I guess we'll move the other two towards uh, getting that driller then. I mean, I'm not going to be able to hit it next turn. It's going to probably dig uh, Charmeleon. Yep. Called it. Is that a person's? No, it's Wild Drill Bar. Prospects are grim. Ow. There's Blaze Range. Bam. Still within those turns. You may be my enemy today, but I sense true greatness in you. I think Yukimura wants a Charizard, which is awesome because Charizard's the best Pokemon. Alright. Move back here. You're gonna die anyway. Teeps. Just grab some stuff. Oh man, he's dead. Oh, he's not dead. Because eh, he was tougher than I anticipated. That's fine. Go grab that. Nom 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 nom. Cool. And we'll finish it off with a good old vine whip. Or not. Stop him from digging. <laughs> it's not gonna stop him from digging, is it? Nope. Let's finally finish this, please. And then it'll be the end of the episode. So, till then, this will be Isaac Zephyr, signing out, and I shall see you all later, girls. <laughs> well, after these, after these two are recruited. Lady Lee, there's a weird old man over there. I'm just gonna tack this on to the, the episode. Hey, 
It's not nice to call people weird, you know. Anyway, I'm just a traveling merchant, so you can stop panicking. And I brought some extra ra special rare items with me today. Well, this is an excellent opportunity to buy some items that will be of use in the future. Alright, what can we do to be today? You know, actually, this will be the beginning of the following episode. Purple Ponagiri, increase energy to maximum level. Raise attack, use a little faint on the fourth turn. Voice makeup for using items or warrior skills the following turn. Okay, those are alright, I guess. The last weapon on standing, that's pretty cool. Fog machine, many critical hits. A little more gold than usual. Collects all items after battle, disappears after one use. Protector enables certain Pokemon to evolve. Metal coat. I can only afford one of these, so let's think about this for a moment. Um. Kind of want Dawnstone. All right. Another busy day. Leave. You know, I should have sold to that guy. I've been collecting items for a while. It looks like we got some gold people, so we'll be doing that when I've organized our troops a little bit and decided what we're going to do, because we're pretty powerful. We could probably wind up actually taking on another kingdom as well, so we'll see what I'm going to do. But till then, this will be Isaac Ziffer signing out, and I'll see you all later, heroes. Oh no, shit.